Hey guys, Havasu Lou out in beautiful Lake Havasu. Hey, we're going to check out a brand new double RV garage pool home. Hang out with us and check it out too, and I'll talk to you in a minute. All right, guys, right here at 3491 Kicking Horse Drive. This one just had a price reduction down to 1.489999. It's a super desirable area. Looks like they're putting in some double RV garages across the street. There's a lot, vacant lot over here that's actually owned by the city. So the driveway is not as steep as it looks in the listing. So this sits on a huge one acre lot. The lot line actually goes all the way up the hill here. So there is a possibility to build more, even another RV garage. There's also over 80 or almost 80 feet of turnaround space up here for RVs, boats, whatever. And like I said, you could dig into this hillside and create even more. Looks like it has an eight foot entry door. Let's go check it out. All right guys, so this house was just completed. It is a four bedroom, three bath pool home. 2,391 square feet. Again, sits on that huge one acre lot. Does have dual master suites, big wide open living area. You have a door to the garage and there's a couple bedrooms down there. We'll go check out off the entry. Big kitchen island with waterfall, uh, quartz counters. Stainless appliances, look like they upgraded the cabinets. Real cool glass tile backsplash. Can lights, folded ceilings. So this is kind of a unique feature with this builder. They put these big pantries in their homes. So you have this huge pantry with a little coffee bar. Same quartz tops. Really like the uh, plank tile floors they did in here. So you have a cool little dining area. Has a little uh, beer fridge, quartz counters. You have a slider out to the backyard pool area. And there's also a double slider off the living room here that goes out to the pool area. You have dual skylights. Real nice tiled fireplace. It's an electric fireplace. Big ceiling fan. So again, that's a double slider. I'm not gonna mess with the blinds because I don't wanna break them. So this is a split floor plan. You have a laundry and the master on one side of the house. Big master. You have a slider out to the backyard pool area. They also did all the trowel down walls and ceilings, four inch baseboards. They did cool uh, double slider barn doors on the master bath. Really nicely done. So a real big space with dual sinks, quartz counters, big glass walk-in shower and a soaker tub. 
did the uh, dual heads with a rain rain head real nice tile work tile goes all the way up to the ceiling and a toilet with its own door so even the walk-in closet has the uh, same cabinets and quartz counters in here as well pretty good size walk-in closet let's go check out the other side of the house so you also have the indoor laundry right off the kitchen and master as well some storage same quartz tops so we're going to check out the very front bedroom this is at the front of the house So this is a junior master suite, has its own bathroom. All eight foot interior doors, including the closet doors here. So you have all the same tile, quartz counters in this junior master suite as well. Glass door, walk-in shower with tile all the way to the ceiling. So you have bedrooms three and four in the middle of the hall and the guest bath. All quartz, same setup, real nice tiled walk-in shower. So you have bedroom number three, pretty decent size. Has the tall ceilings in here. Double slider closet door. And you have bedroom number four. Looks like they're just using it as an office. All right, let's go check out the garage and the pool. All right, so you have a huge garage setup. You have the two car side, 29 feet deep, eight foot door. Both, uh, all three garage doors are insulated. There are two mini split AC units in here. So you have a double RV garage. There is a 45 foot bay and a 66 foot bay, both with 14 foot doors. Has epoxy floors. You have your water heater, RO, soft water, utility sink. All right, let's go check out the pool. We have a killer backyard pool setup. Nice big uh, covered patio, has ceiling fans, can lights. You have some gated side parking. It's probably not big enough for an RV, but you can definitely get a car trailer back there, no problem. They did the nice uh, silver travertine decking. It's the same decking I have around my pool. I love it. It's just a little different. Really nice pool. A couple water features going. Really nice and private back here. Full stuccoed wall. Had the wrought iron gates back here as well. So you have all your ground AC units, your mini splits, and all your pool equipment. Nice little Baja shelf. All 
right, guys, Havasi Lou back again with you. Hope you enjoyed the quick little video walk through the house over here on Kicking Horse Drive. Again, this one was just reduced to 1.489999. I will put a direct link to the listing detail page right below this video so you guys can get all the original listing pictures, current price, and availability. Of course, if you guys have any questions at all, always feel free to reach out to me. All my contact information is right below this video as well. You guys have a great day, and I'll talk to you soon.